safety. Would you like to bring the grill with you? What if the grill is already hot? Well, that's not a problem either because this is designed by TV chef Robert Irvine. You've seen him all over Food Network, and he is a great lover of the great outdoors. He's also a great lover of barbecue, and this really gives a whole new meaning to the phrase, have grill, will travel. Because even now, when that grill is lit, you've got something that is perfect. 153 square inches of cooking space on this grill. This is a grill you take to the beach, if they allow grills on the beach, um, at, to the park, to uh, maybe the lake. Wherever you're looking to grill, you've got a grill that travels with you. If you're tailgating, this is great. Now, let me get some cheese on these burgers, because that's the way God intended it. Lots of cheese on the burgers for summertime. Let me grab a few more slices here. And we'll leave a couple of them plain, mostly because I ran out of cheese. <sighs> All right, there we go. This last piece is stuck to the plate. But that's okay because we're not wasting a morsel of cheese. No, we're not. All right, so all this happens for you at a time when you are looking for something great. This has a grill cover. It also has a warming rack, which makes it new this year. Since May 21st, when we debuted this newer model of the Chef Robert Irvine grill, over 10,000 of them have been ordered just since May 21st. It is now June the 19th. It's not even been a full month, and already over 10,000 of them are gone. Ordinarily, this packup would be a nearly $75 at retail. We are $55.62 today. Five easy payments on your credit card is just $11.12 pennies. Let's go through our color choices, and we have this for you in, I believe, the gray, which is here on the end. There's the gray, and it's done in that ombre effect, where it's a little darker down below. It gets lighter as you come up. On this one, I've got salmon going, and this one is our um, orange. Then I have it for you in the red. This one is, I believe, the black. And this one is Americana. You might be wondering, well, I see the, uh, the blue and the white. Where's the red? It's in the lid. There it is. All right, that's Americana. And then finally, I have it for you in our most limited green with some grilled corn and pork chops. Let's welcome in Chef Robert Irvine, who is a man that needs hardly any introduction. We all know who he is. And if a chef is designing my grill, I'm happy about it. Chef Irvine, it's good to have you back with us, sir. Hey, David. How are you? Welcome to uh, sunny 100 degree Florida. And I'm out Bob here, and I just got back from San Antonio. And it's so funny. Why am I telling you this? because we had a golf tournament for our heroes, Robert Irvine Golf Tournament, and I cooked for 162 people on these very same grills. So look, um, it's an amazing grill, easy to set up, 153 square inches of cook service. You can see I've got these beautiful uh, flank steaks on here. I'm going to make a little taco. I've got some of my family members here this weekend, which is great, before I head off to uh, Portugal and Spain and all that in a couple of weeks. But look at this, flank steak cooked to perfection. It doesn't get any better than that. I've already got some guacamole in my taco shells. Look at this. Yeah, <laughs> hello, hello. <laughs> now we're talking, now we're talking. Happy Father's Day to me. <laughs> Happy Father's Day indeed, Chef. This is what's amazing. And I love the portability of this grill. I love the size of the grill. The color choices, you designed something that really is very portable, didn't you? I did. You know, it's nine pounds. One of the things that, that people always tell me is, oh, we got to wait for the grill, uh, the charcoal to get cold. No. I put the lid on it, and I, if you can see over here, you can see it on the screen there, we can pick it up, literally pick it up and move it with the coals in it, which makes sense because if it suddenly tips down with rain on the beach or your tailgate, you're out running and you're not getting wet. It's nine pounds in weight. It takes 10 minutes to set up. It's probably the most efficient way to cook if you, uh, if you like to cook. And what a great, I know it's Father's Day today, but what a great Father's Day present, 4th of July present. I mean, I carry ours on the trucks uh, when we do Restaurant Impossible. So, because my guys, my builders love to cook. So, there you go. I mean, with chicken wings, it really doesn't matter what you're cooking on here. It's just great, it's simple. It's less, if you think about this, it's so much easier to cook than sticking things in the oven, believe it or not, uh, and it cooks faster. So, Chef, let's talk about assembly. We've got a little videotape I'd love for you to narrate. 
Say that again, David. I'm sorry. Let's talk about assembly. We've got a videotape that illustrates oh, that. Oh, there you go. There you go. Ten minutes, a couple of screws, a Phillips screwdriver, and uh, you're ready to go. And I love yeah, that you can minutes. take this grill with you on the go. This grill portion goes in very nicely. It's got two handles that come out way on the side, so it's easy for you to remove this for quick and easy close up and then for later cleanup because these uh, handles will also fold down for easy storage when you're not using, utilizing this. There's a tray inside that holds your charcoal briquettes. And then here's your warming tray. That is new this year with this model. So now you've got things that can be up and away from the heat source. And there's also a beautiful grill cover included as well. Now, this is our only order of the year. I would encourage you to pick yours up. And what's that? Well over 10,000 have been ordered since we debuted this item back on the 21st day of May. Now, this is the gray. I also have it in orange. This one is the red. Beautifully done in the red. Then I've got, uh, are we calling this black? Black, yes. Okay. Then the Americana is the blue, the white, and the red lid. And fewer than 2,000 of this one to go around. And then finally, I have it for you in the green. Don't miss out on this opportunity. I've got beautiful pork chops here that need to come up and off this grill so they don't get too hot. And then served along with that, some beautiful grilled corn on the cob. Chef, there's room for a lot more on here, too. We could have done other vegetables on here, other proteins. This is fantastic. Well, you can see what I've got. I've got kebabs here. Um, and, and let me just pick one of these up. They're kind of hot. But look at the size of this. That's, that's a meal. Put that with a steak. Uh, I've got sausage over here. And a lot of people uh, don't think about dessert. Well, I do. Look, I've got some amazing, look at these beautifully grilled peaches, right? All I'm going to do, <laughs> this is for you, David. What you this is for. This is for you. I got some little vanilla ice cream on here. And I grilled peaches? I'm in, chef. Grilled pe. Oh, no, it gets better. Watch this. Get that uh, off there. <laughs> grilled peaches, vanilla ice cream, and then here's the wow, a little chocolate sauce. Well, okay. All right. I had you at vanilla ice cream. You I had thought. me at vanilla ice cream, then you went and put chocolate syrup on it. Now I'm drooling. Okay, fantastic. Hey, we've also got cheeseburgers here. How about double cheeseburgers? How about double cheeseburgers, right? Oh, double cheeseburgers. And then regular burgers. And I was able to cook six burgers on there. Probably, and these are the big Kansas City burgers that we had earlier in the show. The big eight ounces, the big Mac Daddies. So don't miss out on this opportunity. We are busy on our phone lines. We are just at the beginning of the official start of summer. When does summer begin? 20th or 21st? 21st, which I believe is Tuesday, isn't it? Tuesday, right? Because today's the 19th, carry the one. Yep, yeah, okay. So we're talking Tuesday is the first official day of summer. So chef, there's a lot of grilling ahead of us. And if you live in the Southern United States, if you live in the Southwest, you're grilling more than just the summer. You're grilling probably all year round, right? Uh, well, listen, I, I, I told you earlier on, I'm on the road 345 days a year. These grills go with me. And you mentioned something earlier, David, about the addition of the rack. You can see here, I'm, I'm actually warming our tortillas. One thing I, I get annoyed at with uh, a lot of chefs is they don't warm the tortilla up and they're hard. And here we have it. It's getting warm. I got my steak. As I said, no matter what you want to cook on this grill, it's adaptable, it's easy, it's fun. And you can take it everywhere. And that's what we talk about, making things efficient, easier to cook with. And that's what the Robert Irvine line is all about, making things easier for you to cook. Oh, you got pound cake. You go to the store and you buy yourself a store-bought pound cake, cut it into little pieces about three-quarters of an inch thick, grill them, and then top it with fresh whipped topping and strawberries. That is a strawberry shortcake like nobody's business. And then... You hit this with some beautiful strawberries. Make yourself a strawberry sauce if you like, whatever you've got going on. Oh, hello. There it is. There are your strawberries. And then the whipped topping. Big dollop of whipped topping. Ooh, let's see if I can do it. There it is. All right. So, and uh, well, I'll borrow some of your chocolate sauce, Chef, and we'll drizzle right over the top of that. I love it. That love works it. out nicely. Chef Robert Irvine, what a pleasure to have you back, sir. 
I appreciate you, David. God bless you. Happy Father's Day to all the dads out there. What a great present. Again, unique to QBC. So what are you waiting for? And happy Father's Day to you, sir. Pleasure to have you back. Now, we also have from Chef Irvine his rice cooking.